Next, we would change the tension spring. The tension spring actually is the part that keeps the tension of the cutter and the comb blade together. Of course, we take our blade, put our, two, our thumb in between the two screws, place it down on the table, nice and tight, loosen up our screws. Flipper blade over. Next, we take our tension spring, lift it completely up. First thing we're going to do is remove our blade guide. Place it down. Take our socket. Push it up. Pull it out. Place it down on the table. Just as it come out. Remove the old tension spring. Take your new tension spring. It's been color coded so you can see it better. Take your socket, go directly into the tension spring at the top, let it drop back, fall. Take your blade guide, place it, make sure it's nice and snug onto your tension spring. Then we go right back into that groove, drop it down. Turn the blade teeth to, to your right, lift up, take your left hand middle finger, put it in the center of the socket, squeeze tight, flip both. And again, make sure you have nice clean holes for your screws. Place your first screw in, tighten, not too tight. Next screw, tight, not too tight, make sure it's nice and snug, that's why you got to make sure everything in place. Again, pull it all the way back, pull it, this blade all the way back, take your ruler, make sure you have exactly the same space on both sides of your blade should be about 1 16th of an inch. Cutter should be set back from the cone teeth. Check it. Make sure they're even all the way across. Once you see that they're even, put your blade in your palm. Squeeze nice and tight. And tighten your blade. That will complete the changing of your parts.